Now we are going to do problem number 5. It says a particle moving in circular path of radius A and it is being experienced by an attractive potential U equals to minus K upon twice R square. We have to find the total energy, right? So we know that we can write F force is equals to minus du dr, right? So here u is given by u equals to minus k upon 2r square. This is the potential energy. So if you do f equals to minus d dr into minus k upon 2r square, right? So this force will be equals to, this minus will cancel, k will come, k by 2 will come out and it will be equals to minus 2 divided by r cube. Alright, so the force will turn out to be minus k divided by r cube. So this is an attractive force and the direction of the force and the direction of the r are exactly opposite. Right, so that's why we, can, we are getting a minus sign. Now this force must be provided the required force must be provided by the centripetal force. So we can equate centripetal force is equals to force of attraction, right? Centripetal force is what? mv square upon r is equals to k upon r cube, right? So from this expression, we got the value of mv square is equals to k upon r square. Now we know the total energy must be equal to kinetic energy plus potential energy. So potential energy is given, you have to find the kinetic energy. Kinetic energy k equals to half of mass into velocity square, which is equals to half of k divided by r square, right? So, and potential energy is already given, that is minus k by 2r square, okay. So, total energy will be equals to kinetic energy plus potential energy, that is k upon 2r square minus k upon 2r square and it will be 0. So, the correct option is option 1. Explore more about the topics you love with Topper. Subscribe now and keep learning.